of our fallen hero, a hero in Rex. Rex died because of us, so that we can enjoy the fruits of liberty. And may Rex soul rest in everlasting peace. Rex will be remembered as a hero who fought to liberate this nation. Nataka ni waombe tu dakika moja tu tusikize kidogo kwa wama vijana wetu ambao wako hapa. Ninajua kuna machungu sana kwenyu lakini ni waomba kwa unyenyekevu tutulie tu kidogo tuendelee mbele tumalize hii function. I want to tell you that the Bible says in the book of Revelation 21:4 that the Almighty God will wipe away every tear from your eyes. There will be no more death. That there will be no more mourning. There will be no more crying and there will be no more pain. For all this shall come to pass away. To the family of Rex, may the Almighty God give you strength to overcome the untimely demise of your son. To the friends of Rex, may the Almighty God give you the strength and courage to go through this untimely demise and the tempting moment. Na shukuru sana. Vijana ria. Vijana ra. Asante ni nataka tutulie kidogo tu. Tuendele mbele. If and only if Ruto wa her president. If Ruto wa her president, he would be here today to comfort with the family of Rex. But he is not. If Ruto were our president, he would be here today to pay his last respects to the young man who's lying here who has changed this country for the better. But he is not. If Ruto were our president or a leader, he would, he would take responsibility for every life that has been lost unnecessarily during this struggle. But he is not. Because he is not a leader and he is a dealer. He is dealing with our lives. He is killing our children. He is on a mission, not on a vision. A vision to kill the young people in this country. A vision to increase the high cost of education in this country. A vision to increase the high cost of medication in this country. And a vision to destroy this country for the worst. And I can promise you, Ruto, that the Gen Z's you are seeing here today and in this country, the millennials you are seeing here and in this country, the Kenyans you are seeing in this country, they will send you into political oblivion. Which is the entombment of the unworthy into their own dust of nothingness. Gen Z Ria. I want to remind you Ruto. That instead of pursuing your selfish political ambition on X space. You should come here and let us have a conversation by the grave of Rex. We don't need to have a conversation with you on the X space. We want to converse with you by the graveside. Rex died fighting for our nation. Other Kenyans died. Other Gen Z's died fighting to liberate this nation. Because the cost of education is high. Because if you go to our hospitals, there is, there, there is no medicine. Because our farmers, our children are going without food, are going hungry, are hungry in this nation because there is no food, because you are selling fake fertilizers to our farmers. And to your surprise, 
They are even selling. They even supplied us the money which was meant for tear gas. They ate it. They supplied us with fake tear gas and that tear gas even caused harm to a police officer and made that police officer lose both his arms because of the money that you ate. And we want to tell you, Ruto, that we want you to come from being a president into being a resident. And we will not reach 2027 before you leave State House. Vijana Ria, Gen Z Ra, Millennials Tibim, Kenyans Tialala, Warembo High, Wamama Mwe, Asanteni.